Ellison. Yes, Brady Ellison made history in 2016 by becoming the first archer to win the Hyundai Archie World Cup final four times. In 2018, Sara Lopez caught up. And the big story at the start of this season was who would be the first to five. You know, we both have four now, so we're tied. So now it's a race to see who gets the fifth, you know, because no one's ever won five before. I don't know why, that there's always this competitiveness in me. And I like being one of the people that's only done that. Both Sara and Brady qualified for the 2019 Hyundai Archery World Cup final with wins at stage one in Medellin. It's here for Ellison. Brady won again in Antalya and both podiumed at least once more during the year. So the stage was set, Moscow, Russia and the race to five titles was on. I'm, I'm really happy with my results. I'm really happy with uh, representing my country, making history, but it's still a long way. And I think the best archer in the world is not the one who wins all the time. It's the one who stays in the top. Lopez's first match was a tight one against Korea's So Chai Won. Coach said it all, excellent day. A brilliant performance from Sarah Lopez. Next up was Sophie Doramont. Lopez, just a seven for the victory. She gets a nine. Her lowest score in this match, but it was enough to go through. And then it was into a final against reigning world champion, Natalia Avdieva. Lopez just needs to hit the target here. Yeah, she finishes with a 10. Sara had done it. Five Hyundai Archery World Cup champion titles. Was Brady up to the challenge? Brady's first match was against Artem Maknenko. Eight points to win this match. He gets a nine. He takes all the points in the fourth set. Then he faced Chef Vandenberg in the semis. Ten, nine, eight. And he gets the nine he needed. 29 means that Brady Ellison is through to the final here in Moscow. It's all led up to this title bout against Italy's Mauro Nespoli. A nine is what's required for Ellison to take the title in what's been a fabulous year for him already. Long hold, big shake. He shoots the nine he needs for the title here in Moscow. He is the 2019 Hyundai Archery World Cup Finals champion. Yeah, I'm so excited. You know, this is my fifth win and it's also, I won my first one and this is the 10th one I've been to, so to win the first and the 10th, I'm just super stoked right now. I uh, finally found the middle of that match when I had to and I, I'm just pumped right now. Uh, I knew I just had to go in there and, and shoot and I really wasn't thinking about what Sarah had done uh, at all. I was just trying to get, get another one for myself. Pues es, es eso mismo, saber qué es lo que me propongo lo logro. Sé que el mundial no lo gané, pero gané tres cosas este año que ni me soñaba, que era Las Vegas, Juegos Panamericanos y mi y quinta final. Entonces eso ya como que compensa un poco con lo que perdí en el mundial, pero sé que en mundiales van a haber miles y esto es un momento único en la historia. The Hyundai Archery World Cup returns in 2020 for its 15th season. Brady and Sara will be back too, as the race for an historic sixth Hyundai Archery World Cup champion crown begins. <laughs>